Hi folks, when I just tried to upload some new videos to continue the work, it read this here. You reach your upload rate limit, please slow down. I'm probably blacklisted and pinklisted everywhere now, so you won't hear from me for a while, in spite of the fact I have a lot of important videos to make for you all. So when you first see this video here, weeks or maybe even months may have passed. I will just continue to edit more videos now, as I have a momentarily place at a fan's place to edit videos. I'll upload more videos when this upload rate limit has passed, if there really is one at all. And when the YouTube strikes have passed, and there will be another two weeks on CIA by the end of June, and another three months on Homeland. I don't trust bit shoes because they don't even have a computer with huge expensive massive computers, servers and all that as YouTube in San Bruno has. But they use a P2P or peer-to-peer -peer system that even the US Navy will have you court-martialed for when an operator would log into a peer-to-peer -peer website which is in fact the biggest spy tool easily bringing gov trojans government trojans into your computer and thus stealing and destroying your data or even doing a false flag saying you did it you know like threatening somebody or you know the kind of things yeah it's a war against humanity against those with critical thinking and against those who share their critical thoughts and proofs. So you have to get your intel right in a war about where the enemy is and what he's doing. Therefore, the necessity to think several moves ahead as in a chess game. And what Tavistock is good at, or the UK 77th Brigade, Brigade cyber soldiers controlling the internet for possible tangos, terrorists, nationalists, lone wolves or critical YouTubers. The 77th are in the uh, Denison barracks in Her Hermitage, in the uh, Hermitage, in the county of Berkshire. That will be that would be Berkshire for the Americans. <laughs> Just as Bitshoot are in the same county of Berkshire in Newbury, Berkshire. As a matter of fact, Newbury is just down the road from Hermitage, Hermitage, which makes Bitshoot practically neighbors with the 77th Cyber Barracks. And it's all next to Oxford, where the elite of the elite are based, and its famous Oxford University, lots of pedophile feudal boarding schools, etc. Yeah, look. Here's Newbury, where the bit shoot is, and here's the Hermitage. And this is only five kilometers. I, I just looked at the map here. This is five kilometers in a straight road, which is leading you right here. So, and there's this road here, the A34, is leading you to Oxford, which is not very far either. But this, you can walk this. It's five kilometers. What is it? Three and a half miles. Or three miles. So, when these are supposed to be the biggest like enemies if you if you like you know uh hermitage where the uh, where the army is who are supposed to be looking for these ones here in the internet from the bit shoots and all the guys on there who, who are in newbury so how come these sort of these ones looking for these ones and these ones trying to dodge these ones so how come they're only five kilometers from each other you still believe that Come on! And there's not only the geographical fitting, but also the chronological. The 77th Cyber Brigade was created in January 2015, and right after, in the next year, Bitshield. It's like Proton Mail, to have a safe mail for those who feel being watched. Well, did you know that Proton Mail is Swiss? and developed by CERN Geneva, the particle accelerator, 
where the, where the entire internet was born. You know, the CIA, they're based in Switzerland. It's all controlled opposition, Lenin, all over it. Oh, you spent 15 years in Switzerland, eh? or 20 maybe. It's all Lenin controlled opposition and they know we want something like privacy in our correspondence or a new censorship free video platform. Let me repeat it to you what Swiss Lenin said. The best way to control the opposition is to lead it ourselves. Bit shoot, proton mail, etc. When all of a sudden the masses all run somewhere like proton mail, bit shoot, I have this little voice inside like damn where did I see this happening before? And look at the name and their logo, the bitch part well we all saw that eh? and I hope the various ladies here saw that too. The shoot part is like in a parachute from the French word to fall, chuter, parachute. So all you bitches will be falling, eh? Or fall into the trap. I mean, bitches like, you know, like you say that in the army, like, you know, like as well to the man, you see. So the word itself has quite some military slang in it. <laughs> no wonder being based next to the 77 barracks. Maybe some, so maybe some Brits pay him a visit. Um, hey, well, you only need one bus ticket, eh? As you can walk the distance from Bitsu to the 77th. And look at the logo, red and white for the Templars, out of whom all military organizations came from. And for Pharaoh's red and white house. And the red circle for the compass, Freemason concept of three. It looks like the red circle is pivoting here to open a door or crack something open. Probably your computer. At least Demolition, damn, what's the name again? Well, anyway, they have real computers and real servers, but France is not America. And they probably have just little computer servers with a small capacity there for the upload rates. All these extra problems are energy sucking and I'll chill I'll chill out the next uh, evenings with some Hollywood movies and screen them for secret symbols which they always do to mark its origins of which I will show you some more in this film here so it won't be altogether that boring and I'll release this film by the end of June on CIA when after three months my strike has been forgotten but probably not forgiven. In order to bypass the censorship, I will title all the following videos Intel 1, Intel 2, 3, 4, etc. Without description data and without tags. And as much as the daily motion servers are not overheated, I will upload that daily motion. While using YouTube here for your comments and discussions, as daily motion has no comment se uh, section. The overheated French discussions blew up some of their servers from what I've heard. So here in the Hollywood film called One in the Chamber you see the Templars cross in the, umbr in the umbrellas. Um, just like in the film Resident Evil. This is not a coincidence. And even more because afterwards they're going to show this here. So not minutes later, but only a few seconds later, they show this here. It has absolutely nothing to do with the film. Why do they show it? Because this means this is a pyramid, the pharaohs, in a circle for the concept of three, for the, uh, the compass. So this means that the Knights Templars, they come out of the pharaohs just a few seconds afterwards, not more than 10 seconds, nothing to do with the film. In this film here, called The Last Night, they show a huge octagon and a little one. All these armies, all these knights, it's all octagon. It's real. Watch my film, Octagon, The Empire of Darkness. So here in the same film, The Last Night, you can see the, uh, the medal hanging uh, around his neck uh, at the bottom of the video. And it shows the, uh, the square and compass. You can see the square, the whole thing is in a square, which is the concept of four. 
and it has um, two triangles um, for the concept of three, which is the uh, the compass, which I explained in some other videos. So it says the square and compass, and it's the same thing I just showed you in the pyramid. It looks really the same here. The base of the, that pyramid was a square, and you saw those triangles in it. You know, like fitting together, like um, like these uh, the sides next to each other, which you can see here. I'm sorry for the Arab uh, letters here, because if you want to l watch a good video, you know, you just uh, put a title or you know anything, a theme you want to see, you put it in the Google Translator in Arabic, then you put the Arabic in your Google in your YouTube. And you can see all the nice videos. You know, they let the Arabs just do what they want. You know, it's, it's, there's no control. I mean, I don't think it's because they can't control the other letter types, the language. It's just, um, it's just the way it is. You know, um, I'm not allowed to use the word because of the censorship. But you know the word. You know. Well, and of course here in the film Resident Evil with uh, Mila Jovovich. You can see the big Templar's cross um, also at the back, you know, in an octagon. It's octagon, and it's the same they just showed in the um, in that um, that that other film. I think it was in Russia, where there was the pyramid and the umbrellas. Well, that was the umbrella corporation. This is this one here. Why do they show it in all these videos? Well, it's the Templars. They're ruling the whole world, right? It's the Templar system, octagonal, octagon. <laughs> Believe me, Octagon is real. Yeah, the Umbrella Corporation, Resident Evil, eh? Well, who are the residents and who are evil to them? Yeah. Well, we are the residents of this earth and we are evil to them. That's what they say. It's, they have to combat us, like with the Templars. That's what it's all about. Yeah, the Umbrella Corporation, so the slaves can even walk around, you know, with the uh, the symbol of, and the of the enemy, you know, with like on badges, jackets, T-shirts for keys, uh, key holders. Well, you, you name it, it's crazy, you know. So you so you walk around with the the symbol of your enemy on your chest. Yeah, look, some more Umbrella Corporation here. And this is what the the Templar sodomists uh, gang what they do you know they have the same moustache the same uniform just like um, Edgar Hoover with his um, well I'm not I'm not allowed to to, to use any words anymore I, I don't know how to describe it with the censorship well you know what I mean eh? Uh, this is in the film Kill Command I think it's from 2016 you see the here these robots they're killing humanity and they're called SARS. This is SAR001 and they've got 002, a whole bunch of them, eh? And SAR in the demotic, as I told you, it means uh, the king, the pharaoh, eh? As in the word SAR, Caesar, Nebuchadnezzar. Well, watch my film, The Swiss Beast. I'll, I'll show it to you there. And like in a sarcophagus, which is a box to put the king in when he's dead. And these things are the are the king beasts you know killing humanity so they use their pharaonic word the enemy within does sar for the ones the kings killing humanity well they are the sars it means pharaoh is killing humanity that's what it means to them it's everywhere they they like a dog pissing in the street they're leaving their messages everywhere and here in the same film called Commando Kill or Kill Command, I don't know, it's actually different names. But you see, the sur it's all blue for the war, right? It's in a Templar's V with three on one side and three on the other side. That's the the concept of three. It's all like a, it's a V-shaped, like the head, you know, these uh, Sar Pharaonic humanity killers, right? And there's the circle for the concept of three, for the compass. And this is because this is them. The concept of three, the compass, is them. I explain it in my films, yeah? Why? And we are the concept of four, the square. That's so that's why the square doesn't show on the beast. It probably shows somewhere else in the film, you know, definitely. Here, I'll give you a, bet, a better pick of it here, a better screenshot. So here you see the SAR, you know, like in the abbreviation mode, like S-A-R. 
for Son Altesse Royale, which is the official title of Prince Charles, Su Altesse Royale, His Royal Highness, you know, and they're killing us. They, they say it openly, they want to kill us here, and they are going to kill us, they're doing it. So stop waiting for, I don't know, for some holy energies or a holy divine whatever i can't even say the word you know because of the censorship you know what i mean w to wake up and stand up you know there's nobody's going to help you no divine powers are going to help you this one is interesting too this uh, picture uh, gendarmerie uh, it, it actually means jean d'arme the people with a gun jean les gens it means uh, the people and they are the uh, the countryside police like in the cities you've got a uh, police municipal a police uh, national and why do you think they so in france yeah so why do you think they put a, a circle around the g right the g of the freemasons like within the uh, square and compass and on the thing on top of it it forms an oval in the middle you know it, it all has a meaning why put a circle around the g well it's all freemasonry and there's a lot of policemen many 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 who are really freemasons here in the akkadian language of mesopotamia it says king of the four corners of the world in the akkadian language it's sar kibrati arba or sar kibrat erbeti you see the word sar meaning the king it's all pharaonic that means mesopotamia you know babylon and all that it is pharaonic it's not mesopotamia that was before no it's in the language egypt and the pharaohs were before uh, mesopotamia and actually the word of a corner the four corners is uh, in latin is canton like in switzerland they have cantons and here in Argentina in 2017, there was a guy who had a, an amazingly Nazi treasure in his house. And you see there the, um, the Sphinx there with, together with the Nazi, uh, with the swastika. So there must be a, uh, a connection, you know, between the pharaohs and the Nazis. As I explained to you in my video, like the Swiss bees, home of the devil and the connection is the Knights Templars. So you see the Nazis, they even put a pharaonic sphinx on one of their marble sort of things there. It's not for nothing that they do this. Eh? Here you can see that again. So that means that's why they call it the thousand year Reich. You know, they want it to last for a thousand year. So the first, uh, thousand, the first thousand year Reich was pharaonic and th this is this is the third one eh? it's all connected they've been ruling over us for two thousand years and they want to kill us all hey you can see a uh, picture of the uh, the alpine alpina lodge in zurich switzerland where hitler got initiated in 1923 you all see the pentagram on the in the um, in the building and it looks a bit like a pyramid with the ball of the world domination in it with an octagon fountain in front of it and a statue of Helvetia, which is a representation of Isis. So look carefully at the pentagram. You can all see that. I, ca I can give you a, a screenshot of it if you want. There you go. The pentagram, satanic symbol in the Zurich Lodge, the Alpine, Alpina Lodge, where Hitler got initiated. There you go. Well, it's all interconnected. It's the same ones ruling for thousands of years and they want to kill us all it's interconnected you see it the same signs appearing you know in the old age in the prehistoric age now even the nazis they had this sign there the templars cross the joseph mengele connection in switzerland and this terrible swiss serial killer who went to the united states and god knows what he did there um it's all connected eh? so on the right hand side you got uh thomas nick we did a terrible crime on the day the swiss 
they terrorized me and my entire family. This guy, he murdered an entire family while the police should be there protecting that family. Uh, and at the same time, they terrorized my family and me. Uh, this is the same bloodline. I mean, look at the guy. It's the same. Mengele was living in the north of Switzerland, just as this guy here. It's the same. No pity for his, for his victims. Completely cold crimes. Uh, and they think it's normal, you know, it's all perverted and all of this. It, it's, the, it's a connection, it's it's pharaonic connection, folks. It's all connected, eh, Swissy?